In a recent blog post, uh, Infinity Ward announced that the fans will be able to vote for the modes included in playlist updates via Twitter, giving them more control over what they play. It said, one week per month, Infinity Ward will be creating a Twitter poll for fans to vote on for that week's playlist from a rotating pool. Uh, the devs seem to have kind of gave this idea already in the past with a Twitter poll asking, you know, players what of the three kind of options would they like to see in a rotating, uh, you know, pool. So they had to shoot the ship, uh, shipment and shoot house is kind of the options. Uh, I think that's a good idea, even though it's not going to give the community complete control over that playlist. And I was kind of hoping that would be the case, considering a lot of times they still remove a lot of the playlists people really want to see. And I was hoping to see more options of new maps coming out. That's one thing that I saw a few days ago. Players were talking about, you know, maps being remade going forward in Modern Warfare 2, you know, for the next year and a half pretty much or longer because we don't have a new Call of Duty game coming out to 2024. And a lot of people keep, you know, talking about, oh, we want this map remade, this map remade. And while there's still a lot of great maps from MW2 and MW3 that have not been remade, the majority of the maps that get remade are things we've seen year in and year out. And I was really hoping that Infinity War would have some new map ideas and also a better way for players to control what playlist they are playing. So giving a, giving us the option to pretty much vote on the playlist every month for, you know, the entire month. That would have been a really great idea. Instead of giving us the ability to do it one time, I wish we would have had the option to really control what playlists are available. Or maybe even give us the option to choose what maps they remake or if there's going to be brand new maps. Because I think a lot of people out there would like to see brand new maps. I think this will still be dictated by the developers. Um, they're still going to be able to pick the remaining playlist for each month. So it's not like, you know, we're going to have control for the entire playlist. But at the same time, it does give us a little bit, I guess, more balance to give the community what they want more than just what the, the devs have decided to add to the game. But leave me a comment with your thoughts. Are you excited about Modern Warfare 2 uh, Season 2? We've got a lot of information about it lately, what exactly is going to be changed in Warzone and in multiplayer. I think some people are excited. Some people are, are kind of still hesitant exactly how all this is going to play out going forward, considering this update has gotten delayed. We'll kind of have to wait and see if these major changes really help the game out and bring players back to multiplayer. Because I feel like right now, there's a lot of players leaving Warzone and multiplayer, which is kind of a shame because Call of Duty has been such a great game for a long time. But over the last several years, multiplayer has kind of suffered, in my opinion. And now it seems Warzone's kind of seeing the same fate. So hopefully the devs can kind of get it in order and we'll get some better playlists, some better game modes, and some just better overall changes to the game in general. Of course, if you liked the video, hit the like. If you had not subscribed yet, please do so, and I'll catch you next time. Peace.